it's Tiffany. I am here with the brand new Tiny Tuckins Playhouse. I want to thank the company for sending this to me for free to open up with you guys today. I'm so excited for the Tiny Tuckins. Just so excited. You can see a little preview of one right there, the little baby, because we do get a three-piece plush family inside here, bedtime accessories, and a fold-out bed. I don't know if there's anything on the back here. Let's flip it around. Ooh says, Playhouse set includes mommy, daddy, and baby plush, a fold-out bed, and a closet, and accessories for lots of fun. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Let's get this open. I have it out of the main wrapping, and we have a tiny tuckins right here on the door. This is made of cardboard, like real heavy-duty cardboard, just to let you know. Now let's go ahead and open this up. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's a little... I'm freaking out. Oh my gosh. These guys are actually a little bigger than I thought. So we do have the baby. The baby I did take out. We'll take a look at them in a minute. I want to make sure I go through everything here in the house. I'm freaking out. And this is so cool because not only can you play with the tiny tokens with this, but you can play with several other dolls. Like, I don't know, LOL dolls, Polly dolls. I don't know, any kind of dolls. Anything you want in Calico or Anything. You can play with anything here. This is such a nice little house. No, wait, what's this? Is this just, okay, that's just extra power. I just want to make sure. So we can kind of position it in any which way we want, and I'm going to go ahead and spread it out. So we have kind of like the dining room over here with a little window. And let me just move this out of the way for a minute. And we have the kitchen, of course. And we, that pretty much takes up the majority, which I'm actually surprised. I thought maybe the like living space would take up a majority. And then it looks like we have a nursery over here. So I'm a little sad that there's like not a living room. I would have rather had like this be the living room and then this be the kitchen or something. But other than that, I think, I, I think this is really, really cute and I'm really excited. Oh my gosh. I like having it positioned like this kind of, or actually you could kind of move this out this way. So it's separate. That's so cool. So cool. By the way, I don't think I showed you the entirety of the house. It just has windows printed and uh, flower bushes. I love them. But anywho, this is so exciting. Now we did have this closet, this wardrobe here. It does say we have instructions here. So it says you have a fold down bed closet instructions. Okay. So this is one of those really cool things. Um, but <laughs> this reminds me of those ones that come out of the wall, the beds that come out of the wall. So of course we have the like wardrobe right here. I like the texturing on it. Now to fold it down, okay, fold fold down bed comes in the, oh, so like, like this. Oh wait, no. Yes? No? Yes. Oh, no? Yes. Like this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, ta-da. So that's like the mommy and daddy's bed. That's actually really, really cool. I like that. So we have a nice uh, uh, space saving house here. I'm gonna go ahead and, I think, well, this is really cool because you can treat this like a window as well. That's so neat. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put it back into wardrobe function just to save us a little space. We could just kinda, if I can get it back to wardrobe function, there we go. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put that kind of off to the side, kind of, you guys can't see it, I put it on the other side of the room. And then, what are we gonna take a look at next? How about, all right, we'll take a look at the baby. So of course, we have a crib. Now the crib, so far everything's been made out of cardboard. Heavy duty cardboard, I'm really happy with the quality of it for being cardboard. Now, ooh, the collector's guide, so you guys, there are several of these to collect. I have blind box videos coming. I have, um, I think they're like family pack videos coming. It's gonna be so exciting. So we have the checklist here. Yeah, see these are, this is what I was talking about, like the family packs, but I guess they're just, and eh, we'll call them family packs. And we have the playhouse. And then these must be from the little blind boxes. I'm so excited. I can't wait to do those videos with you guys. Now, is this, this family, it has a, has a name, right? Uh, playhouse with mommy Evelyn, daddy Ezra, and baby mouse kings. <laughs> so anyway, we have, oh, the crib came apart there. We have a crib. It is made of plastic. I'm really happy that that's actually made of plastic. And it does say tiny tuckins here on the edge. I'll go ahead and put that over here in the bedroom. We do have two hangers and they are made of cardboard. We can use for the wardrobe. And then we have this little itty bitty bottle, which of course, gotta have that for the baby. 
Moving on. Well, actually, let's go ahead and look at the baby next. She is in this little mouse kins is in this height chair. This height chair is so low to the ground, but that's really cute. Kind of like maybe just one of her bedroom height chairs, you know, because we don't have a kitchen table. But here's a little baby mouse kin. She's so cute. And I have to say, I really love the quality of these plush. Let me actually get you guys a closer look at little baby mouse kins here and her family when we get to them. So all of this is embroidered, all these features, so, so cute. She's very, very soft and she has this little diaper that you can actually take on and off, which is so adorable. So I'm sure with the other babies you can mix and match their diapers if you wanted to. She is all plush and I just love how she's so detailed and it's just, oh, I'm so excited for these, like really, really excited. I'm going to put her in the crib look at our mommy and daddy and other accessories that we get inside this bag. So, Mommy Evelyn, right? I'm going to double check on that because I'm terrible with names. Yes, Mommy Evelyn. So, Mommy Evelyn, I like how they have clothes. I'm just so excited. Anyway, she has this little bow here. Again, she has all the embroidered features just like her little daughter over there. Now, she does have embroidery in her ears when the daughter did not, but that's okay. Um, and then we have the outfit that actually can come off. You can mix and match outfits. So if she wanted to wear uh, whatever the dad's wearing, she can do that and vice versa. And she has a little bow on her tail. I love that little feature. And these clothes are so cool. I love, I, guys, this line has so much potential and I like, you can do clothing packs and like all kinds of stuff. I'm just so excited. And again, she's so super soft and all plush as well. She does have printed on shoes, I guess. I'm not a huge fan of that. I kind of wish she would just have like nothing. But that's okay. I think it looks cute. I'm going to have her kind of sit in the kitchen while we look at dad over here. This is daddy Ezra. He looks like he just got back from work at the office. He has a nice little tie and uh, uh, some uh, some pants with a belt there. Now these pants are elastic here so you can take them off and then you can actually untuck the shirt if you wanted to. I'm going to kind of leave it as is because I think it looks good. Um, does he have, I guess he does have printed on shoes as well, which I'm getting used to. I kind of really like them, you know, that way you don't have to worry about shoes or them not having shoes. But he has pretty much the same feature. Well, actually, it's quite interesting. They don't have the exact same features, so you can tell they are printed differently. You know, she has eyelashes, she has different shaped nose and mouth, which is really, really cool. I like that a lot. But they are the same color scheme and all that. So I'm just so excited. They have a little baby. And, oh, gosh. So anyway, we also got some extra clothes, which, yes, is amazing. Now we have nighttime PJs for mom. And we have nighttime PJs for dad. So I'm not going to change both of them because these are the same exact PJs basically. They're just in different colors. So, and it does say JJ I think on that. Is that, should have been like mousekins or something. I don't know. But they are the same exact. So cute. And then you can use your hangers for this. I don't know though. Let's test it out. Yeah, I guess you can. It's just like, you to be careful. There you go. That actually works. It's not too bad. So I'm really excited about that. Oh man. And then it's not over. We have a blanket for little baby mousekins, you know, because we don't want her to get cold. This is actually made out of more of a rough fabric than all of the other fabrics, which is interesting. Kind of would like to have seen maybe a softer baby blanket for her. Uh, we have lace. Don't worry. Like I am in love with this. So there, everything I, I'm criticizing, I'm like try, uh, not trying to find things wrong, but it doesn't really mean. I love this. Let's just say I love this. <laughs> I make it sound like I don't like it with all my criticism, but like honestly, perfect. I don't think we can get any better. And then we have the last thing. We have blankets for mom and dad. Actually. Yeah, I mean, they would share the same blanket unless, you know, they need two blankets, which is awesome because that'll keep her warm in the winter. But we have kind of like a, a pink themed and a blue themed, kind of like the pajamas, you know. And it is the same material as the baby blanket. It's kind of more of a, it's like, it's very thick. Maybe it's like double. No, I think it's just, I just think it's thick. I think so. I'm not sure. But anyway, that's kind of like my only complaint. These kind of should have been softer for being blankets, especially like since these are softer, even the clothes are softer. I 
like these and you can even use this in like the baby's room for a little play mat. There's just so many possibilities with this and these are that's everything that we got in this pack. I'm ecstatic. And there you have it. That is everything for the Tiny Tuckins Playhouse. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to open up more of the Tiny Tuckins. They are one of my new favorite toys for sure right now. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you guys think. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.